In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix DirectX error on your Windows 10 computer. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Before I start teaching you how to fix any DirectX errors that you might be having, I want to say that as you can clearly see, I am recording this process on a Windows 11 machine. But don't worry, the methods that I'm going to show you are also going to work for Windows 10. I apologize for this, but I have no means of going back to Windows 10. Anyways, first, what you may try to do is update DirectX. There are various ways to do this, and the one that I recommend is to go over to the Microsoft website. So first, go to Microsoft.com and look for DirectX and user runtime. You can simply look for DirectX Microsoft on Google and access this page. Select your language over here from this drop down menu and click download. A setup like this will be downloaded. And once you run this setup, all you have to do is agree. So accept the agreement here, press next, and then install DirectX. I'm not going to proceed with this installation because I already have DirectX properly updated on my computer, but this is all you have to do. Just click next, next, it is extremely straightforward. Once you are done with this process, restart your computer and try using any application or game that requires DirectX 11 and see if the issue goes away. If it still doesn't work, the next thing to update is Windows. So look for Windows Update, you should be able to find a Windows similar to this one, and what you have to do is click Check for Updates. Once again, extremely straightforward, give it some time, make sure that it checks for any possible updates, and if it detects that files are missing or it needs to be updated, give it some time. Once it is done, once again, restart your computer and try running any application that requires DirectX 11. If it still doesn't work, the last method that I want to present can be done through the device manager. So look for device manager on your computer, and once you open it up, you will find one category called the display adapters. What you can do here is either right click the display adapter that you have and then select update driver, search automatically for drivers and let Windows update your display adapter drivers, or alternatively, if you have a dedicated GPU like me, when it says NVIDIA or AMD, what I would recommend is to go over to their official websites. So if you have something like Intel, HD graphics, Intel, integrated graphics, just right click and go into update. But if you have something like this, an NVIDIA or AMD GPU, visit the website and look for your specific set of drivers. So for example, for me, I need the drivers for an AMD Radeon RX 7900 XTX, but you might have something like GeForce RTX 4070, 4080, and so if that is the case, visit the respective website, look for your series of cards, and then the specific drivers that you need. Again, the same can be done on the AMD website. Once you have the display drivers properly updated, just repeat the same steps as before and you should be good to go. By updating DirectX, the display adapters and windows, you are going to ensure that any issues attributed to DirectX are going to go away. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix DirectX error on Windows 10. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.